Dinos here again today, I'm bringing you guys a short little video, um, maybe, I don't really know how long it's going to be, but uh, I got something in the mail today and it's taken me, what's today, the 26th, it's taken me 27 days to get it, and uh, that's another story for another day, but uh, I might throw it in the video at some point, I don't know, I got to get finished getting everything set up, I'm going to do a little unboxing video at first, and I think I'm going to tie it into a setup video and show my kind of setup, because I did have somebody ask me recently, um, what kind of stuff I use and that kind of thing. So I figured, you know, this is a good time to show it. But uh, let's see what we can do here. There is the old box. And, uh, crap, I don't have my knife. My knife's in the car. Alright, so I'm going to grab these keys here. As you can see, this is a before picture of my setup, okay? I have all these cords laying on the floor. I've got my 360 sitting down there. I've got... Um, the Xbox One on top of the <laughs> on top of the Direct TV, my controllers, my headset, all that stuff is just crammed on there. Running to the TV up here, and uh, it's just it's not pretty. So I'm going to be moving it into that room over there that you can barely see through the doorway, and uh, make my own little room out of it. So we're going to open this thing up, and hopefully it's not going to be something terribly crappy because. It's been a long, drawn-out process on getting this thing. And, frankly, at this point, I just want it to work. And I just want it to go the way it should. And, man, this is not easy to do while holding a camera in your hand. But, maybe I should have opened it beforehand. We'll see. Holy crap, they taped like half the box. What the poop? Alright, there we go. I think it's open now. Okay. So, I ordered... A, oh crap, I just tried to power off the phone, okay. I ordered a monitor from BenQ, and it was refurb. It was supposed to be refurbished, and they told me they were going to send me a new one, because it ran out of refurbished, so we'll see. Um, I'm no expert, but that does not look right. But we'll see. That looks like it kind of broke from something. But maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Okay, well, we got a stand. So that's good. Um, we got a stand. Here's the power cord. And what in the crap is this? I've never seen this kind of bubble wrap before. Holy crap. Well, it came with a VGA cord. So I don't know what I'll use that for, but I'm sure I can find something. And here is said monitor. We'll sit it down on the floor over here. It is a 24-inch monitor. Um, it, uh, it has five or 12 million to one contrast ratio, two or five millisecond response time. I can't remember something like that. But it's full high def LED, as you guys can see right here. It says LED, um, HDMI, all that good stuff. Low light blue sensors and all that good stuff. And it's supposed to have built-in speakers, if I remember right. I may be wrong. I think it has built-in speakers. If not, it's not really that big of a deal because I can hook in my own speakers and all that stuff anyway. So, uh, but there it is. And I want to try to go get it all set up and show you guys an unboxing or a uh, finished setup product. So, I hope you guys will stick around and find out. We'll be right back. Alright guys, here we go, finished product. Um, as you can see, I still got a little problem with some cords over here, but that is because the Elgato has so many dad blame cords. But uh, this cord is actually coming out of the Xbox, it's my controller charger. But um, as you can see, I got my PC hooked up here to the Elgato that's running to the Xbox One and the monitor. I don't know if you guys can really tell how clear that is. It looks, it doesn't look too bad. Um, I don't know if it really looks as good as I thought it would, but I mean, it still looks pretty dang good. Um, down here, uh, let me sit down on the floor here. Down here, I've got the Xbox One here with my Bluetooth headset here, the Black Ops 2 headset and all that stuff. Got my games stacked up right there. Uh, more games over here and one of my 360s here. I decided to leave the other one in the living room in case we wanted to use it for like a DVD player or if my wife wanted to kind of just sit down and mess around and update on the speakers i figured out that this does have speakers but as you guys can see right here i've got a sub back here i've got uh, a tweeter and over here i've got 
wherever it's at. There it is. There's another one. Um, so I use that because the speakers were just freaking terribly useless. So I threw those on there, but uh, I got that. I'm still working on my chair, and honestly, I don't know how much I want to be able to use this uh, entertainment center here. Don't ask me why I have it. It's a long story, but um, it is really short. Like, let me guys show you. Um, well, I mean, you can tell comparison. That's the Xbox One. It's sitting on the floor. It's, what, like four inches tall? It's like this big. And that thing is barely a little bit higher. Like, my laptop's almost as high as the freaking thing. Um, so, <laughs> we'll see. But, uh, I mean, I'm standing up right now. And if I look straight ahead, I look at the window. And you can't even see the actual, like, gaming stuff. So, that could be a problem. But, um... <laughs> Uh, we'll f I'll figure something out, but I got my little mini fridge over here and before I show you guys the rest of this room I do apologize for the mess this up until right this moment. I've had no use for this room It has literally been a storage room for all the stuff that I did not feel like unpacking So most of the stuff I have is unpacked But there's still a few boxes here behind me that I'll show you guys that are not that are just closed and random things that I haven't really needed um, but I got my little mini fridge from the first year I went to college, got the dresser here, it's got all my random junk just piled on it. Uh, I've got, I've got comic books, I've got Yu-Gi-Oh cards, oh, well, there went stuff. I've got the Avengers box set movie, like, collector's edition. Uh, there's more Yu-Gi-Oh cards right there. I've got stuffed animals, I don't know why. Um, that is not coffee, by the way, that's actually, like, uh, a can with all kinds of coins in it. Got a lava lamp. Got my, some of my collectible stuff up here that my sister got me and I got from different things. Um, I don't know what those are. I honestly, like, I think there's a router in here and this has just, or this has random crap. This has a router. Um, yeah. And then we come over here to this corner. Got my cut rack. Got a um, box full of random stuff and a couple crates full of, like, sports equipment and things. And a little bit of, like, school supplies. Got my guitars put up right here. Eventually, I'm going to have some stands for them. I do have one or... I think I have two stands. I just don't have them put up yet. There's my amp. Um, and there's the boxes that I was talking about with some clothes. I just haven't put them up yet. And here is the random computer that I had that was that just crapped the bucket a while back. Which led to me getting this one. So, uh, you know, closet space. All that good stuff. And like every man needs... You can see my church clothes. Or my ties are hanging on here in a shirt that I didn't have a hanger for. Um, but... <sighs> professional midget basketball goal yeah buddy but uh hopefully this looks a little bit better than it did at the beginning of this video um, i do apologize for it looking so terrible but i think it's because i was in front of the window this looks bad i'm sorry uh, i can't really tell i'm looking at the back of the phone so but uh, i hope you guys enjoyed i uh, got the setup and everything good good now so hopefully everything will go well i can get some stuff recorded for you guys but um like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and uh, if you guys want information on the monitor I bought, I can send you a link to it. Um, like I said, I got mine refurbished, so it was on sale for a good bit cheaper. It was literally over half off when I bought it. But, um, yeah, if you guys want any information on my laptop, my monitor, uh, anything technology-wise, if you just even have some questions, uh, if you think something is, or if you want to know if something is a good buy or not, um, you can ask me. Um, I will let you know. I'll, I'll talk to you about techni you know, technical specs and things like that for computers and monitors and all that stuff. If you guys need some help, um, most of it's pretty straightforward. So I would think you know, a lot of you guys will know. But if, just in case you don't, you know, I am here. If you guys need it, send me a message on Twitter, Facebook, uh, on the channel, whatever. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys later. Peace.